Hey guys, I'm Pratt Ryan here, and um, I um, went to GameStop today. I know a lot of people don't like GameStop because it kind of rips them off. But I went to GameStop today, and I picked up four games. So the first game I have here, it's a, it's a Resident Evil game. I, um, I played a lot of this game, and then I sold it, and then I bought it back today. And I bought all these four games for like $16, and I, I actually heard they're really good. I only played like two of them that are on this list. The other two I didn't play. So the first game we got here is Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City. And I like this game. I like the shooting. You can play with your friends. The co-op campaign. Um, I like the whole scenario. It was really fun for me. And yeah. Um, it takes place in Raccoon City. You play as like the Umbrella Forces. And I really liked it. So I bought this. And... Um, if anybody wants to play with me, I'll put my gamer tag in the description. And yeah, Operation Raccoon City. The next is a game that got really bad reviews. It was kind of like stumped on. Not too many people liked it, but I heard it was good. Because it's like, um, it's like games you can, what would you do type stuff, you decide. So, I downloaded, I, not downloaded, I bought this game, Alpha Protocol. I heard a lot of people don't like this, but it's, it looks promising to me. It, like, it looks appealing to me. So I'll be looking forward to playing some of that. And I might give a review when I beat it. I'm not sure. But yeah. Up for protocol. The next game I played. It's. It, I kind of got it because I, at the time I played Duke Nukem Forever. And I wanted a game that was similar to it after I beat it. Because I did like Duke Nukem Forever. I don't know how many people liked it or not. But um, that was a game that I bought for two ninety nine, No, like one ninety nine, And that's... Prey. This game is like really solid. It's an alien shooter. I liked it. And uh, it's it looks really promising. Um for because I never beat it, but I played a little bit of it, and it looks really promising to me. So I am gonna get into this more. I'm gonna play it and I might give a review about this. If this video gets a lot of, enough attention, I will. So yeah, I pray. And then we have a, a game that I hear so much about. So many people talk about it. They're like, it's a really, really good game. If you don't have it, get it. Put it in your collection. So I'm like, it was cheap. It was $6. So I'm like, why not get it? So that game is Ensla Enslaved. Odyssey to the West. And I'm really looking forward to playing this game. Um, I heard so much about it. Mostly positive feedback. So I'm like, yeah, I gotta play this game. Because I really want to get, I really wanted to get it for the time being. So I picked it up, and it looks really promising. It has so many mechanics. People say they were like, they compare it to um, The Last of Us. You know, it's like two people who like, who like hate each other. They despise each other at first, and then they work together and they start liking each other. They become close, close people. So yeah. Those are my four games that I picked up today for $16. Couldn't go wrong. And there was actually one more game that I picked up. Hold on, let me put this down for a second. And that game is Fight Night Round 3. I picked it up because it was primarily cheap and I wanted another boxing game. So I got this one. I don't have any boxing games, if you know. I only have UFC. So yeah, here's another game. And I played like a couple rounds. With my brother, beef was in there. <laughs> but I played a couple rounds and I really like it. I wanted to get the newer ones. So yeah, thanks guys. Pan heart out.